So you have Windows 10 installed and are ready and raring to go. But hold on to your horses, here are a few settings you should change right now to optimize your Windows 10 experience. Windows 10 makes a big deal about bringing back the start menu, so why lose it when you switch between desktop and tablet mode? To keep it on all the time, go to Start, Settings, System, Tablet Mode, and switch the Make Windows More Touch-Friendly toggle to Off. You get enough notifications from your smartphone, right? Here is how to turn off Windows notifications on your desktop. Go to Settings, System, Notifications and Actions. Then just flip the switch for Windows tips, notifications, or anything else you might find distracting. Windows 10 keeps itself updated, but that can sometimes mean your machine just automatically restarts when Windows Update has done its thing. Annoying! You can schedule a specific restart time and go to Settings, Update and Security, Windows Update, and choose your time. Or if you want to be notified when your machine wants to restart, go to Advanced Options, then choose Notify to Schedule Restart underneath the Choose How Updates Are Installed menu. If you use the Express settings when installing Windows 10, you probably enabled Wi-Fi Sense. What this does is automatically connect you to Wi-Fi hotspots or to networks that your contacts have shared. To turn off Wi-Fi Sense and sharing, go to Settings, Network and Internet, Wi-Fi, Manage Wi-Fi Settings. Or you can also type in Wi-Fi settings into Cortana or the search bar to bring up this option. I'm Lexi Savides for CNET. For more settings to tweak and our full guide to Windows 10, check out CNET.com.